And you know what I realized? That as a child of God, we are operating in enemy territory. The child of the devil will take the principles we have placed, run with it, and succeed easily. But a child of God, you can pack all the principles I've been discussing, working with them, and you can still fail woefully. Because we are operating in an enemy zone. Do you know what Jesus said? Jesus said, Jesus said, the prince of this world. The devil is a prince of this world. So whenever he sees a child of God trying to succeed, the thing that he does is to what? Resist him. That's why he went to Jesus. Do you know what he told him? He told him that I will give you the kingdoms of the world and its riches if you will what? Bow down and worship me. Let me tell you something. There is no man who will go beyond the average in wealth and prosperity that the devil didn't check him out. Forget about them. You know, I heard some men of God saying that unbelievers are rich. They don't be tight. They don't do this. They don't. Let me tell you something. <laughs> there is the law of spiritual exchange. Just like the devil came to Jesus and said, I will give you if you will worship me. Let me tell you something. The devil does not grant access beyond the ordinary to any man who have not worshipped him. Don't be deceived. It is say, oh, that the first 10 millionaires, they don't pay tight. Let me tell you something. They are sponsoring the kingdom of darkness directly or indirectly. And the devil send them riches. I knew you, Rosa, we are a child of God. Hey, I want to be kingdom financier. I want to do this. Do you think the devil will leave you? You apply all these principles, you will still fail. So it is a two-pronged approach. While you're applying all the principles we mentioned, you must realize there are spiritual principles if it's indeed God that will help you.